Over the past week, I've made $2,000 just by posting YouTube shorts. Take a look at this channel. It has nearly 2 billion views, close to 10 million subscribers, and earns up to $11,000 a month. All the channel does is post AI-generated cow story shorts. Now, take a look at this short I created in just a few minutes using AI in the same niche. In a quiet Indian village, a humble farmer owned a cow like no other. It vomited money and even gold, but a jealous old woman boiling with envy bought the cow from him at first. She basked in riches, coins, cash, and more. But one day, the gold stopped. Desperate, she made a strange potion to bring the gold back, but it was too late. The magic was gone, and so was her joy. She wept beside the cow, learning too late, some things aren't meant to be stolen. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to start a channel just like this, from scratch. I'll walk you through how to create and optimize your YouTube channel, how to generate viral YouTube shorts, and best of all, how to do it completely for free using AI, channel creation, and SEO. Before we start with the main video, we first need to create and optimize our channel to favor the YouTube algorithm. I'll take you through creating your channel logo, banner, and most importantly, how to optimize your channel for SEO. Feel free to skip this part if you already know how to do it. So first, you need a conversational AI tool. You can use ChatGPT, GrowK, or DeepSeek. I'll be using ChatGPT, so sign up for an account. Now, paste this prompt into ChatGPT. The link to the prompt will be in the description box. In the prompt, I asked ChatGPT to give me 20 creative channel names. I've left a space where you can fill in your channel niche and tone. For example, I'll write AI animated cow stories for the niche, and the tone will be emotional. Now click the Generate button. As you can see, ChatGPT has given us some very good name options. Okay. So now copy your favorite name and go to YouTube. Paste it into the search bar and search for it. Now filter the results to channels. As you can see, no one has this channel name, so we can use it. Next, go to your YouTube account, click on your channel icon and select Create Channel. Paste in your channel name and click Create Channel. Now go back to ChatGPT and paste the second prompt. Fill in the necessary details so we can generate a good channel description. Then, go back to your YouTube channel, click on Customize Channel, and paste the channel description. Okay, now go back to ChatGPT and paste the third prompt. Fill it in as usual and click Generate. ChatGPT will give you studio-relevant hashtags, which help YouTube push your channel. Copy those tags and paste them into your channel description. Finally, in your YouTube studio, click Settings, then Channel, paste the hashtags, and click Save. Logo Creation First, copy the logo prompt and paste it into ChatGPT and fill in the spaces according to your channel niche and tone. Now hit the Generate button. The prompts will be in the description box. Next, copy the first prompt result. You can create your logo using any AI image generator, preferably Microsoft BIMGINIG Creator, Leonardo AI, or ChatGPT's image feature. But in today's tutorial, we will be using BIMIG Creator. After logging into Bing, paste your prompt and click Generate. As you can see, the logos generated with Bing are very good. I also tried generating a logo with Leonardo AI, and those turned out great as well. Now, let's go back to ChatGPT and try the other logo prompts. As you can see, all the logos are similar in concept but styled differently, so you can pick whichever one fits your brand best. After downloading your chosen logo, go to YouTube and upload it as your profile image. A uh, banner creation. So now we are at the final part of creating our channel, which is our channel banner. Paste the banner prompt into ChatGPT, making sure to fill in the necessary details about your channel. ChatGPT will generate prompts to help you create four banner variations in different styles. Copy the first prompt, head over to Bing. Paste the prompt and click Generate. No need to select the image size. The results are very good. Now let's try the other prompts too. 
I decided to go with this particular image. Since we can't upload the image directly to YouTube as it is, we'll use Canva to adjust it. In Canva, click the plus icon above, search for YouTube banner, and select the template. You can find banner guides on YouTube, or you can use mine which I will leave a link to in the description box. We do this so that the banner is properly visible across all devices, TVs, tablets, phones, and desktops. Now, upload our banner image and make sure it covers the safe area text. Now, in the Elements tab, search for a white or gray background. Add it and ensure it covers the background area behind the text. Now, click the banner, click Layer, then select Forward to bring your banner to the front. Make sure to arrange everything neatly. Once you're happy with how it looks, export your final banner and go to YouTube to upload it. You'll now see that your banner looks great and is properly displayed on all devices which is a big win for your channel's branding. Okay, so now we are done with our channel creation. Now it's time to get to the main video. Script and ideas. So now we're at the most interesting part of the video, creating our story, voiceover, and image prompts. We'll be using ChatGPT to generate all of these, but you can also use Blackbox AI if you prefer. I created this custom prompt myself and I'll be using it. It will be in the description box, so go ahead and click Generate. As you can see, ChatGPT has given us a great story, image prompts, and a voiceover script. It has also separated the narration, which will make things easier for us. But before we continue, I want to quickly share how you can come up with great story ideas. One of the easiest ways is by checking out other channels in your niche. Look at their most recent popular videos, study the concept, and then put your own creative spin on it. Also, uh, last tip. Make sure to craft your stories in a way they evoke emotional response, thus creating a connection between the viewer and video. This will create engagement and make your video go viral. Voice over. Before we start, make sure to copy the narration from ChatGPT. For the voiceover, we'll be using All Voice Lab, which gives you 300 minutes of voiceover credits for free. Yes, completely free. Let's sign up. After signing in, as you can see, you've been given the credits I mentioned earlier. You can even clone your own voice, all at no cost. Now paste the voiceover narration. Next, let's check out the available voices. First, filter them to English. Hi, it's Jake here. Picture me as the friendly neighbor who brings a- Hi, I'm Clara. My voice is warm, steady, and heartfelt. If you're looking to true- Hey there, my voice is clear, bright, and easy on the ears. Deep, rich, and magnetic, that's me. Every word I say carries the weight of experience. I think I'll go with Ethan, but there are also six main languages to choose from. You can also increase or decrease the speech speed, but I'll leave it as it is. Now click Generate Speech. Let's take a listen. In a quiet Indian village, a humble farmer owned a cow like no other. It vomited money and even gold, but a jealous old woman boiling with envy bought the cow from him at- Sounds great. Go ahead and download it. So just in case you want the voiceover in another language, go to Google Translate and paste the narration. There are so many languages you can choose from. I chose Hindi. Now copy the translation and head over to TTS Maker and paste it. Now search for the language you pasted and select it. Select a voice of choice. Now scroll down and enter the capture code and click Convert to Speech. एक शांत भारतीय गांव में एक साधारण किसान के पास एक ऐसी गाय थी जो किसी और से अलग थी. Now you can download it. Images and visuals. This is where all the fun begins. We're about to create the images and visuals. First, go to ChatGPT and copy the first prompt. Then, head over to Meta AI. This is a free tool by Meta with no limitations whatsoever, but make sure you visit their official website via Google. After logging in, paste your prompt into the generator. To improve the style, add 3D animation, Pixar style at the end of your prompt, and hit generate. I've noticed that when you do this, Meta AI gives high quality, chat GPT style visuals. So now our images are ready. But there's a small issue. 
they aren't in the preferred aspect ratio. Don't worry though, click on the aspect ratio button and choose the ratio you want. For this project, I'll select 9 to 16. Now click Generate again. As you can see, our images are now in the correct aspect ratio. Let's say you want to make a change to the image. For example, changing the background to a forest. Just click Edit. Type your change, like Change Background to Forest, and hit Generate. You'll see the updated image right away. To convert your images into animated video, simply click the Animate button and wait a few seconds. You can now download your animation by clicking the Download button. Now, let's try the other prompts for more scenes. Just so you know, our story is about a cow that vomited money and gold. A jealous woman buys it, but then it suddenly stops. No matter what she tries, the cow never vomits money again. One last tip. To stay organized, I recommend placing all your videos and images in one folder. This will make editing and uploading a lot easier. Editing, uploading, and monetization. Now, it's time to put everything together. We'll be using CapCut for this final step. Start by uploading all your videos and the voiceover into CapCut. First, drag the voiceover onto the timeline. Then, begin adding the video scenes. Make sure to arrange and trim the scenes so they match the flow and timing of your voiceover. Next, let's add some high-quality sound effects. Go back to ChatGPT and paste a prompt asking it to generate sound effects for each scene, but tell it to only include necessary effects. While most people still use Pixabay to find sound effects, that method is a bit outdated. Here's a better option. Copy the sound effect descriptions from ChatGPT, then head over to Eleven Labs and sign up. Click on the Sound Effects tab, paste your sound effect prompt, and click Generate. Eleven Labs will give you four different variations. Let's take a listen. Choose the one that sounds best, then download it. Repeat this process for all your remaining sound effects. Now, go back to CapCut and add the sound effects to your timeline, using ChatGPT's guidance for timing and placement. Once you're done, export your video. In a quiet Indian village, a humble farmer owned a cow like no other. It vomited money, and even gold, but a jealous old woman boiling with envy bought the cow from him at first. She basked in riches, coins, cash, and more. <laughs> But one day, the gold stopped. Desperate, she made a strange potion to bring the gold back, but it was too late. The magic was gone, and so was her joy. She wept beside the cow, learning too late, some things aren't meant to be stolen. Now, we are done with our video, it's now time to upload it to YouTube. Go to YouTube and click Create. Then, Upload Video. Click Select Files and choose your final exported video. Next, enter a video title and a short, relevant description that matches the title. To boost your SEO, head over to Rapid Tags, paste in your video title, and click Generate Tags. Copy those tags, return to YouTube, scroll down, and paste them in the tag section. Make sure to select No, it's not made for kids. Finally, set your video to Public, and click Publish. Voila! You just uploaded your first YouTube video. Now. Let's talk about monetization. The most obvious method is through the YouTube Partner Program, where you earn money from ads shown on your videos. Once you meet the monetization criteria, 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours. Another great way to earn money is by selling merchandise. For example, you can design and sell t-shirts with cow illustrations or themed apparel for animal lovers. Lastly, here's a lesser known monetization method. Background music licensing. Usually when you use music from other artists, they earn a share of your revenue. But recently, a company called Digital Bridge Music reached out to me with a great opportunity. I can promote their music and earn a percentage of the revenue they generate from premium YouTube views. Here's my dashboard. As you can see, with just 5,000 views, I earned a few cents. Imagine what's possible with a million views or more. 
If you're interested in this method, reach out to me and I'll connect you with the company. I hope you succeed on your YouTube journey. See you in the next video.